Hey guys, um, I've already made this video several times, so I'm going to do this quick, which is good for you guys. So, um, I had a dream a long time ago. It was one of my first ones. It was the kickoff event dream. There was a part I left out of the dream, and I always just said like one little part of it, but um, I left it out because I initially thought it meant something bad was going on with my husband. <laughs> And um, I'm laughing because when I when I explain the dream, you'll all I'm gonna explain the dream as I go along, okay? All right, I'm gonna start now. So um, in the beginning of the dream, we get to this big house, this huge house, and um, it's a vacation home, and we're on some sort of vacation. My immediate family's there, but there's other people there. I don't know. There's a lot of people there, and I know that they're all staying there. And we all, we brought in, like, groceries. We had groceries on, on, in this kitchen, like, all over the counters and stuff. And then we started looking uh, for chicken. And I couldn't find chicken anywhere. Like, we couldn't find the chicken. And um, it was a big part of the dream. I remember it was important. Like, we could not find the chicken. Okay. And at that same part of the dream, I'm looking at my phone, looking at these maps. And I'm like, where's my husband? Like, where's my husband? And I'm, like, getting flustered, and I'm, like, worried about, like, when's my husband going to get here? Where's my husband at? What's my husband doing? Like, <laughs> and guys, my husband's never given me any reason to be worried about that. But I was so worried about it when I first got this dream. Because the enemy had, like, oh, man, it was just a time in my life, okay? I was, like, so worried about everything all the time. I wasn't resting in God's peace, right? And, um, and so, I'm sorry, I think it's, and so, um, what I realized was I made this video, okay, I'm trying to explain this to you guys about this dream and how the connections I'm seeing here. I was looking on the maps for my husband to come, for Jesus. I was looking for Jesus. I was getting so worried. I'm like, where's Jesus? Like, when are you coming? Jesus, gosh, you better come. Like, where, when are you coming? Okay? My husband. And if you go back to my previous videos, what have I been doing? Looking on the maps. Looking on the maps. Wondering where Jesus is coming, you know? So, that's coming true now. And I didn't even realize it until, like, I started making the video um, to tell you guys about... Uh, a part, and I was going to tell you guys what I thought about that part, and then the Holy Spirit revealed to me what that actually meant. So I'm going to continue on. Then we're outside, okay, and um, I see these swans flying up in the sky, and I sh show my son, I'm like, look, look at these, look at the birds, and they swoop down, and he runs to go pet one, and as he puts his hand out, I slap his hand out of the way, and it bites me, and as soon as it bites down, it turns into a kimono dragon. And I fight this, like, kimono dragon, this huge, nasty-looking lizard. There were several of them. And I fight this dragon lizard thing, which I had never seen one before. But when I went to go look up the, these lizards, um, I saw that there, there was, the lizard it was was a kimono dragon. And um, then, after I fought that, the kimono dragon, I yelled, Someone give me a rock! Someone give me a rock! And I was looking at my baby son, but I was speaking to him like he was my older son. And um, because at the time I didn't have a baby, you know. And so I'm like wondering, why is he not listening and giving me a rock? And finally he, he like got it and got me a rock. And I like knocked this thing out and then the scene switched. And so then... That part's happened because now I'm ha now I have my son Thomas, so originally I thought it was Hollister standing there, but it was Thomas Thomas because he is a baby. And um, then I'm up in the air in this new scene, and I'm up in the air with Jesus, and Jesus looks down at all these people, and I know we're in a giant mansion, and there's other mansions inside of it, and Jesus says looks down at all of this multitude of people. And they all have on Alabama sweatshirts. And he's like, are you guys ready? No, no. All right, I'm sorry. He says, oh, man, I like your sweatshirts. And then he's like, are you guys ready 
to enter your mansions. And everyone's like, yeah, you know. And then um, he counts five, four, three, two, one. And everybody runs in. And that's the end of the dream. So um, I wanted to show you guys. Um, I'm going to be making a series of videos showing the connections. Now I'm not going to make individual videos on each channel showing all the connections. Because I I really I wouldn't be able to do that and still have the time. Um, but I will do a few videos like just pointing out each person that I'm I'm seeing come under one accord or they're not coming under one accord we've all been under one accord but we're being brought together now the Lord is gathering us up we need to become of one accord to get out of here and to call him down we need to send our prayers up to heaven and I have a, a, a dream that I need to share with you guys about the maps as well as our prayers going up to heaven and, um, and there's a lot on that, but just watch this really quick. We're in heaven, we're in heaven, and I don't know. You guys, that was the kitchen I was in. I'm dead serious. When I made this video the first time, I just got filled with the Holy Spirit when I was telling you guys. Um, the Lord is doing so many things. And, and not one thing is not, is not important. And, and everyone's things are connecting, okay? Um, just, just look at the time on his stamp on his video. One one hour, 23 minutes, and 48 seconds. All right, there's one, two, three, four. It's not just numbers. It's keywords. Everyone's using the same keywords. That's how the Holy Spirit speaks. And the enemy speaks from one person to another through these keywords, through the through their spirit. And they understand what, the, each spirit understands what it's hearing. Okay, but the same happens in the Holy Spirit. And we are coming under one accord. And we're seeing. And we now we've grown in the Lord. And we've studied ourselves to be approved. And we've been doing this long enough. Watching for him long enough. That we can now see and know. If we're talking to someone who is safe. And is of the same spirit. Or if we're talking to someone who is not. And the Lord is doing this for our safety. And for however long we're going to be here. Be it you know, maybe a week or two into something bad. I don't know. The kickoff event, he showed me that we are counting down to the kickoff event. That's what that dream is. I just wanted to show you guys. Um, I will have more connections soon or a connection video whenever um, I get another second to make one. But I love you guys and I'll talk to you.